All right, team. All right, BFit Nation. Welcome back to another Motivational Monday, team. I hope everyone had a great weekend, a new Monday, a new week, a new time to set new goals for ourselves. So let's get settled in. Let's grab our towels. Let's grab our water. No need for a mat today, but if you have it for comfort, go ahead and grab that. If you have any resistance, such as dumbbells or a kettlebell or anything with a handle, some maybe some resistance bands, we'll try and apply those as well, but no need for a resistance band. But if you have any resistance like dumbbells or kettlebells or anything with a handle, let's go ahead and grab those, get settled into your workout space, and thank you for joining us. Once again, this is BFIT Live, all right? This is our time to focus on ourselves, focus on our strength, on our cardiovascular system, all right, building up that strength and cardio respiratory uh, system as we progress through today's workout. So with every BFIT Live, we have four workouts that we're going to go through, four movements that we're going to go through rather, all right, four movements for today, okay, the timing for today is 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, four rounds and one minute rest in between each of those rounds, all right, once again, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds and one minute rest in between each of those rounds. Sound good team? All right. Um, <clears throat> just like every BFIT Live, we will go ahead and I will go ahead and demo today's workout for today. All right, I'll demo each of the four movements before we get started. We will jump into our dynamic stretching to get our minds and our bodies ready and prepared to work. And then we will go directly into our workout with just under a 20, All right, team. Well, here we are. We're back. So just under a 20 minute workout for us to progress and build our strength training. So with that, Beef and Ambassador Roy Montes here. Let's go through our four movements for today. Okay. Take away any coaching cues, any tips, any techniques that you can. So that way you can uh, make sure and hone in on our form. All right. Our correct form as we go through these movements. So for exercise number one, movement number one, we have 20 seconds worth a, of a dumbbell alternating reverse lunge, okay? So 20 seconds worth of a reverse lunge and then 20 seconds worth of a plyo lunge. So what this is gonna do, this is gonna focus on our strength with that reverse lunge. So nice, correct form, focus on that form, focus on that controlled movement from there. We're gonna go into plyo lunges for 20 seconds. So that first 20 seconds of work, you're gonna stand at the top of your workout space here. You're gonna take one leg, you're going to extend it back. Dumbbells can be left and right side here next to your hips. Drop down into that reverse lunge, making sure that that front knee tracks over that toe, keeping your chest up nice and proud, rolling back those shoulders, right? Keeping those shoulders back, try not to cave in and try not to lean forward, okay? Keep up nice and upright as if you were sitting in a chair, dropping down into that 90 degree bend of that front leg and that rear leg. Stand back up nice and tall, Feet shoulder width apart. Once again, alternate leg, step back and down. Reverse lunge for 20 seconds. Out of that reverse lunge, we're gonna drop those dumbbells and then we are gonna go into 20 seconds worth of a plyo lunge or a plyo jump. So we're here, absorb the weight, here, absorb the weight. All right, that should get our heart rate up and elevated with those 20 seconds of a plyo lunge. So once again, so alternating reverse lunge for 20 seconds for exercise movement number one. And then out of those 20 seconds, we have 20 seconds of plyo lunges. Same great form, same great cues from that reverse lunge. Second movement here, we have a three-part push-up. So for 40 seconds worth of work, we're gonna get into that high plank position here. Okay, so three parts here. So three reps per grip, if you will. So we're gonna start off with that close grip push-up. Hands are gonna be just inside of shoulder width apart from that high plank position. We're gonna activate our triceps here, three reps here. Nice flat back, keeping those hips square. Pushing back onto your heels, right? Keeping that nice, great tight form. Core is tight and engaged. Navel is pushed back towards our spine. So close grip here, three reps. Out of those three reps, you're gonna go into that standard push-up press position. So hands are just under shoulders or right outside. Drop down, keeping those elbows tucked in close to our torso. Three reps. Out of those three reps, come out into a wide grip. So a wide push up here. Hands are gonna be facing in a 45 degree angle. I find that that's most comforting on my wrists. Dropping down, elbows are out. 
one, two, three, kind of mimicking a chest fly, okay? Mimicking our chest fly with that wide grip push-up. After that wide grip, you're back into that close grip, then a medium grip, standard grip, and then into your wide grip push-up, okay? We need to regress. Let's drop down to our knees, same great form. Close grip here, medium grip, and then into that wide grip, okay? Remember to keep our hands at chest level as we press up. All right, exercise number three, jumping press, either with dumbbells or without. So think of a jumping jack here, front rack, rack position here. From here, you're going to extend up into that nice jack position, nice star position, and then back in. So activating those shoulders, as well as gaining a little bit of cardiovascular intensity here with that jack press, okay? Keeping those legs moving nice and strong from in to out as we press up with that out position. Okay, that's gonna be exercise number three. Exercise number four, we are back on deck here for shoulder taps. So back into that high plank position. Hands are gonna be directly underneath our shoulder. So stack that shoulder that elbow and that wrist, nice and tight, nice and strong. Feet are shoulder width apart, opposite hand to opposite shoulder. So right arm, left shoulder here, keeping that core nice and tight, nice and engaged, left hand to right shoulder and keep on moving through those shoulder taps, all right? 40 seconds of work here. If we need to regress, again, let's drop down to our knees here, hands underneath shoulders, extending out and then keeping that core nice and tight as well, okay? All about that core stability, okay? making sure that we keep our core nice and tight for this one, all right? Those are gonna be the four movements for today, team. How does that sound? <laughs> Hello, Marie, good morning to you. Thanks for joining our BFIT Live program, all right? Stay with us today. It'll be a good one. It'll be a nice work, a lot of strength resistance here, a lot of strength and cardio-based movements to hybrid us out. But with that, those are gonna be our four movements for today, okay? So dynamic stretching up first. First and foremost, <clears throat> let's get comfortable here. Grab that water. All right, grab that towel. Dynamic stretching here. So just like before every workout, you want to make sure to get your mind and your body prepared to work. So dynamic quad stretches up first. We'll go through a few of these dynamic quad stretches or a few of these dynamic stretches rather before we move on to the workout. So about 30 seconds for each movement here. Dynamic quad stretch. Take that right leg, extend it back towards your glutes to push those hips forward. Opposite hand up and overhead, reaching as high as you can go, okay? Sit in this movement for about two to three seconds, pause, and then go ahead and alternate left leg and right leg, left arm and right arm here. Dynamic quad stretch. You should feel that stretch in your hamstrings. I'm sorry, in your quad. <clears throat> Hip flexors pushing forward, keeping those glutes activated. Shoulders upright here, head is overhead, hand is overhead. There we are. All right, let's go at our own pace here. We need to sit in it a little bit longer. Let's go ahead and do that. We've been seated for a, seated for a long period of time. This may help out opening up those hips, getting some blood flow to our lower extremities and our shoulders here. All right, let's warm up that next movement with a reverse lunge and an overhead reach up to the top of your workout space, right leg back, extending back out, hands overhead, and then nice soft reach over to that lead leg side. All set, left leg and right leg. Good, go at your own pace here. We do have those reverse lunges up first. So this will get us nice and ready to work for those reverse lunges. Good, good. Welcome Monday, welcome to our Monday nice and strong today. Nice and strong this week. There we go. There we are. Last one here. All right, team, lateral lunges here. Let's go nice wide stance here. Feet are a little wider than shoulder width apart. Fix those feet so that way your toes are nice and forward and stay forward, okay? We're gonna shift our weight from our right side, absorbing that weight, and then over to our left. Keeping that chest up nice and tall, pushing those hips back and sitting back into that lateral lunge. All right, nothing too aggressive here, but we just wanna get that stretch into the inner portion of our thighs. Blood flow is moving, quads are working, 
Glutes are activating, chest is up, just getting ready to work here. Good. Go your own pace here. Sit in a little longer if you need to. Two more, one, two, good. All right, team, standing nice and tall, we are going to kick relatively straight leg to the left and to the right, trying to meet our hands here. Good. Should feel this stretch in your hamstrings. Good. As you go across your body here, left leg meets right hand, right fingertips. Good, nice tall stance here. Really engaging our hamstrings for this one. Nice smooth kicks here. A few more. Four, three, two, one. All right, keeping with our hips here, moving our way down, hip circles here to the right rear, to the right front, left rear, left front. All right. All right, team, where are you watching from? Let me know where you're watching from. Let me know where you're joining from, team. How was the weekend? Did we stay moving? Did we stay activated? Did we stay locked in? Remember those goals that I mentioned early on through the year? Well, we're six months in. Are we keeping track of our goals? If not, it's time to revisit that six month checkup. <laughs> six months here. I hope we're staying on track here. If not, let's get right back on it. All right, team, those are the hip circles. Let's go into YTW just to warm up our shoulders and our mid to upper back for those presses. And then we will be good to go. Nice big Y here, feet shoulder width apart. Here's our center. We are up into that Y. Left hand, right hand, nice and tall, back to center. Left to right side with that T, squeezing that mid to upper back, just with a little pause and a big W here. Again, squeezing those shoulder blades back. Chest is up nice and tall into that W. Big Y here. Good, big T, squeezing your quads, activating your glutes, nice strong stance, big W. Show off those biceps here, good. Big Y for the last round, squeezing taller left and right, a little higher, good. Big T, good, big W. Setting in that one, all right team, there we go, there we go. Shake it off, towel off. Any extra movement that you'd like to accomplish, do it now here. While we break, pour some water, grab that towel, grab the water. I'm gonna set that timer and we will get started here. Mm -hmm. All right, team, hope we're ready to work today. Again, a hybrid workout for today. Exercise number one, movement number one, 20 second dumbbell reverse lunge, 20 second plow lunge. Exercise number two, movement number two is that three part push up, close grip, Medium grip, your center grip, and then that wide grip. Exercise number three is that jump press. And exercise number four are those shoulder taps. All right, setting the timer here. All right, team, let's get to work here. 10 seconds, 20 seconds of that reverse lunge, and then 20 seconds of that plyo. Grab that weight, grab that time. Time's ready in three, two, one. All setting reverse lunge here. Nice, strong movements here. Really, really driving up to standing position through that front leg, chest stays up nice and proud. Really focus on our breath here. Last eight seconds, and then we're gonna move into plyo, plyo lunges. Out in three, two, one. All right, team, let's drop those weights. Plyo lunges here. Now that our quads are nice and fired up, our glutes are fired up and activated, pushing through with plyo lunges. Really exhausting that lower body in three, really putting some tax on it in one and time. 20 seconds of rest here, then we have that three part push up coming up. All right, team, 13 seconds here. Grab that water, grab that towel if you need. Three part push up. Remember, part one, close grip. Part two, medium grip, three reps of each, and then into that wide grip. Let's get settled. Two, one. All right, team, close grip. Here we go. Just inside, shoulder width apart. Three reps here. We need to regress. Let's drop down to our knees. Medium grip. Two, 
three. Nice controlled movement here. Wide grip. Good, back to center, back to close grip. 18 seconds. Good. Keep pushing team. Last 10 seconds here. Nice wide grip, pushing through your palms. Last three, two, one, time. Good job, way to finish that one team, way to finish. 15 seconds of rest here, then we have those jump presses. All right, sticking with those dumbbells. All right, five seconds here. Let's get it team, out in two. One, we are up, we are working here. We are working. Good. If we do not have any resistance here, go ahead and rep through without any weight. Make those nice strong fists. Find a pace that's comfortable for you. Remember with those overhead presses here, you can really catch up to you. Take your time here. Last 12. <clears throat> Good. Out in five, three, two, one. Good job, awesome work team, awesome work. We are back on deck here, shoulder taps to round out round number one. Then we have a one minute rest period. All right, team, high plank position here. Hands are gonna be underneath our shoulders, most support. Up in three, two, one. Nice strong plank here, feet. Shoulder width apart or a little wider. Opposite hand to opposite shoulder. Try and minimize the swaying of your hips. Keeping that back flat. Hands are underneath our shoulders once again. Take your time with it. We need to eliminate the shoulder taps. Let's go into a high plank position, okay? Just hold that high plank. Tuck it in, that navel to our spine. Last eight seconds here. Out in five, last three, two, one. Good work team, good work. 60 seconds of rest here, grabbing some water here. Towel off, hydrate, and let's jump right back in it. How are we doing team? Where are we watching from? Let me know. Let me know where we're watching from. Good job, good job. Stay with us here. Once again, if you're just joining our BFIT Live, Roy Montes here, we are, uh, <clears throat> we are working through a four movement workout for this morning or this evening or afternoon, wherever we are joining from, okay? Um, four movements for today, okay? Our timing for today, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds, three rounds now, and one minute rest in between each round. We have 10 seconds left. Let's go ahead and stand up nice and tall. Reverse lunges with plyo lunges. Coming up in four, three, two, one. Let's go. 20 seconds of our reverse lunge here. Dumbbells can be close to our side here. Remember that, keep that chest up nice and proud. Good. There we go. Remember to sit back in those hips. Sit back in those hips. 20 seconds here. Let's drop the weight here. Plyo lunges here to finish out those last 15 seconds. Good, if we need to drop the lunges, drop the weight and just go back into that reverse lunge, but a little faster, let's do it. Last three, two, one, time. Good job team, 20 seconds here. Three part push up coming up. All right, for some lower body work, now to hit a little bit of our upper body activity here. Catch our breath, nice deep breaths in. Exhale as you push up in two, one, close grip, medium, wide grip, three sets, three reps. Good, there's your close grip. Medium standard push up. And then we're into that wide grip. Activating a little bit of our outside of chest. Back to close grip here, feel this in our triceps, primarily isolation. Back to medium grip, almost there team. Last 10 seconds, 
Good, into that wide grip. Keep that chest. Press to the ground, last three, two, one. And time, team, time, time, time. Take some break, take that break, take that break. Good, how are we feeling, how are we feeling, how are we doing? Good job. I see those likes coming in, let's go. Eight seconds here, dumbbell press, grab that weight. If not, nice strong fists. We are up in three, two, one. Shoulders activated, let's go. Who has a workout test coming up, let me know. <laughs> Anybody have a PT test coming up? Who has that ACFT test coming up, let me know, Army. There we go. Nice and strong, stay with me. Good, last 10 seconds. Out in three, two, one, and time. 20 seconds of rest here. Then we are on deck for those shoulder taps. Last movement to round out round number two. 10 seconds here, team. Catch our breath. Let's get down. Let's get ready. We are up in five. Low, low rest periods here. Here we go, team. High plank position. Hands are underneath our shoulders. Stack them. Right hand, left shoulder. Left hand, right shoulder. Keeping those hips nice and squared to the floor. Right? Try not to dip them. Try not to sway them. Deep breath in. Exhale as that hand reaches your shoulder. Think about contracting your core. Hold that breath in for a pause. Last 10 seconds. Good, if we need to regress team, let's go to our knees here. Last three, two, one, time. 60 seconds team, you have earned it. You have earned it. What, is the, what, is the, what does the weather look like for you today? I know here in Texas, we're reaching 90s with the humidity of very high. <laughs> and I only mention that because today where I'm at, it feels like that indoors. <laughs> so we're breaking a sweat here. All right. We came to work, came to work today. I know we're starting to warm up with weather. We're looking to move these workouts outdoors. Perfect. Take take your cell phone with you outdoors. Let's get it. Let's get it going. Let's enjoy some of this weather that we have. Okay. Twelve seconds here. Then we're back up to round number three. All right, team. Back up. Let's go. Three seconds here. Two, one. Twenty seconds of our reverse lunge. Nice and tall, team. Push those hips back. Good, drive up to that heel. Pushing off to that rear toe. Think about that breathing once again. Five more seconds and we switch to a plyo lunge. Two, one, drop that weight. All right, let's finish out. Nice and strong. Get some air here with that plyo lunge. Use those arms for momentum. Last five seconds, team. Stay with me. Three, two, one time. Good job, good job. Kicking off round number three, team. Three part push up coming up in 10 seconds. We are back on deck. We're just joining us. We're joining on that three part push up. Drop down and join with me. Close grip, medium grip, wide grip. Three reps each. Let's go. 40 seconds on. Here we go, team. Close grip. One, two, three. Your standard push up grip. We want a hand released. Let's do it, team. <laughs> that wide grip. Here we go. <sighs> Back to close grip here. 20 seconds. Standard grip. Give me those hand release. <sighs> there we go. Back into that wide grip. <sighs> Let's keep working. Last five seconds. Three. Two, one. Good job, good job. Way to finish that one out, team. Way to finish it out. 15 seconds here. Dumbbell, jump presses. 
in 10. Bring those dumbbells, bring them over. Up in three, team, two, one, front rack. Here we go, 40 seconds of work. How are we doing, team? How are we doing? Stay with us. Stay with us, BFit Nation. Good. Really think about that full extension on that push, overhead push. Good, stay with me. Now we're feeling it, feeling the burn here. Last eight seconds, finish it out. Five, three, two, one, good job. Good job team, good job. Take a quick break here, 15 seconds. Then we have our shoulder taps to round out round number three. How are we doing team? Eight seconds here, good job, good work, good job. Three seconds here, shoulder taps coming up. 40 seconds of work team, let's go. High plank position, stack those hands underneath our shoulders. Opposite hand meets opposite shoulder. Good, good. Try to keep those hips square to the floor. I know it's tough. Think about our foot placement here. The wider your foot base is, the more stability you'll have. So just outside our shoulder width, will get you a little more a little more stability out in 12. Stay with me. Drop to our knees. Let's get it. Last five. Out in three, two, one. Time, team. Time, time. Take that breath. Take that breath. Take that breather. Move around. Stretch around. Shake it off. Towel it off. 50 seconds here. This is where we get to reset. Reset with those three rounds and looking to push harder through that last round, last and final round, team. Last and final round, BFit Nation. Catch our breath here. Good, good. We limit ourselves on our 20 second rest period to keep our heart rate elevated, to keep our cardio moving, right? To keep our blood flow pumping, to keep our heart rate going, going, going. Good, good. 15 seconds here, we'll catch that breath. Get it under control. We have those alternate reverse lunges with the plow lunges split by 20 seconds each. Up in seven. Last five, last round, last round, best round team. Let's get it. Three, two, one. Let's work. Good. Really sit back to that reverse lunge. Really drive up through that heel. Keeping that chest up nice and proud. Find your pace, find your comfort level. 25. Good, stay with me team. Good. Drop that weight, drop that weight, plyo lunges. Coming up, finish out the last 15. Good. Again, use those arms for momentum. Work on explosiveness through that front leg, through that rear toe. Last two, last one, passing it off. Last one there. 15 seconds here, three part push up. Coming up in 10 seconds, team. Stay with us, stay with us, team. Seven seconds. We are on the floor here. Three, two, one. Close grip, medium grip, wide grip. Three reps each position. Good. Lay with your chest. Keep that back flat. Reset those hands between your close grip, your medium grip and your wide grip. Keep it going, team. Good. Medium grip and release. Good. Last 10 seconds. Good. Medium grip. I'm sorry, close. Ah, two, one. Time. Good job for those of us who finished it out. Way to work, way to work. Stay with me, stay with me. Good job, good job. I see you, I see you. 10 seconds here, dumbbell jump to press. Grab that weight. Up in five, team, up in five. Last three, two, one. Here we go. 40 seconds on the clock. Good. 
Nice and strong. Let's go at our own pace here. A little bit of weight goes a long way for 40 seconds here. Halfway there. Find a tempo that works for you. Good. Keep it up, team. Last 10 seconds. Last round, best round. Finish it up. Out in five, three, two, one. Good job. Way to finish it. Put those weights down. You won't see them again today. Good job. Coming up on our last movement for today, those shoulder taps. Core nice and tight, nice and engaged. Finishes out nice and strong. Five seconds here. Three, two, one. High plank position coming up. Last movement for today. Stay in that high plank position if we need to. Make sure we're pushing back through those heels. Good. Good. Think about spreading the floor with your hands. Fingertips are nice and wide. Good. Hips are square to the floor. Out in 10, out in 15, sorry. Almost there. We're almost to that 10. Now we're out in 10. Good. Keep wrapping it out. Last five. Give it everything you have here. Out in three, hold it. Two, one. Time. Be fit nation, good job. I applaud you, I applaud us. Good work today, team, good work. Catch your breath, catch your breath here. Give yourselves a round of applause. Great way to finish here, great way to finish off strong. That last set, team, that last set is our best set. So as always, great way to finish nice and strong. With each Monday's Be Fit Live, we like to start our mornings, or maybe it's afternoon or evening where we are watching, right? Like to start, continue, or end the day with a little bit of ourselves in mind, right? Focusing on ourselves, trying to put ourselves, our health, and our wellness, trying to make it a priority here. With our Exchange BFIT program, we have a lot of options that we have to help lead a BFIT lifestyle, right? And our Exchange, our main exchanges, we have our BFIT department to find anything from athletic wear to sporting goods, sporting apparel, excuse me, rather. Um, you know, we have things that can help you move in the right direction, right? Move, 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 stay active. Forward is forward here in the right direction, right? With our BFIT department, you step outside of the main exchange. If you go to our exchange restaurants, 1700 plus exchange restaurants, and we offer better for you options at each one of those locations, right? Browse the menu, look for those healthier options, look for those better for you options. Look for those better for you options in our exchange restaurants. We have wellness services that offer a variety of wellness services from eye care to hair care to body and maintenance care, okay? All right, any type of medical equipment that you may need, the exchange offers in the mall areas, okay? You step outside even further, usually right around the street, hit up one of our express stores, okay? We have a lot of healthier choices that are marked on each item, okay? We have more than 450 more than 400 items that you have available to you. So they're marked with that healthier choice item. Look for that tag as you're browsing the items through our exchange, our express stores. All right, making it easier to lead a healthier lifestyle team. The exchange is here with you. I am here with you. Our Be Fit program is here with you team. All right, to help you stay ready, to help you stay resilient and to help you stay fit. So with that team, I hope you had a great, wonderful workout today. All right, way to kick off or end your Monday. I wish you the best week possible moving forward. All right, let's continue to progress. And if you're looking for any additional workouts team, let's look for our exchange <clears throat> playlist, our BFIT uh, Facebook playlist rather. If you scroll down on our Facebook page, look for that BFIT playlist. We catalog all of our previous workouts, our previous live workouts for you. Each one of them has been different, all right? Almost a year, coming up on a year with our BFIT live program. So more more workouts are available for you on our Facebook page and our YouTube page, head over to our YouTube page at Shop My Exchange. All right, look for that BFIT playlist catalog there as well. Okay, Facebook uh, is there, Exchange uh, YouTube is there, and shopmyexchange.com forward slash BFIT, our Exchange Hub BFIT page. Find nutrition, find wellness services, find gear, articles, find nutrition. Okay, everything is highlighted here at, at shopmyexchange.com forward slash BFIT. 
All right, team. Well, I hope you had a great workout with me. I enjoyed every minute of it. All right. Stay strong, team. Stay strong. All right. Ah, shout out to the Army, rather, actually. 246 years Army's birthday is today. So celebrating Army's birthday today. Happy birthday, Army. All right. Stay strong, team. Army, Army. Stay strong. All right, BFIT Nation. Signing out here. Ron Montes, signing out. We'll see you next Monday.